one winter's night when the cold wind blew, the engines found it hard to sleep, suggested Toby, agreed Percy, added Doc, said Thomas, so everyone listened, began Thomas. There were three little engines who lived in their own little shed on their own little railway. Their names were Duke, Stuart, and Falcon. Duke was the oldest and named after his grace, the Duke of Sodor. He was proud of this and loved to keep the little ones in order. Whenever they did anything that Duke thought wrong, he would say, Other engines came and went, but Duke outlasted them all. Stuart and Falcon used to call him Grandpa. They were fond of him, but they got very tired of hearing all about his grace. Sometimes they would tease him and chant. Duke would say, After that, Stuart and Falcon became really useful engines, and all three were happy together for many years. Then, Hard times came. The mines in the hills closed, and the railway was closed too. People came to buy the engines. No one wanted Duke. They thought him too old. They tried to be brave and cheerful, but no one really thought their dreams would come true. Duke's driver and fireman oiled and greased him one last time. They sheeted him snugly and said goodbye. Then they had to go away and find work. Duke was alone. Winter torrents washed soils from the hills. Trees and bushes grew all around. Wouldn't have known a shed was there, let alone a little engine sleep inside. Cried Percy, murmured Thomas.